Hey, what's up everyone? It's 53 Plays, and welcome back to Shadow Gates. We're here in the coffin room. I did take a very brief look at a walkthrough because I did not know what to do next. So here we are, um, let's see, go back to goods. Okay, so we don't have this. Let's go ahead and open this middle, this, uh, middle coffin on the right here. We have this bag here, so let's take this. Okay, let's open the bag. And we have these cop coins in here, so we're going to go ahead and take all of these. Oops. Cop coins in hand, and cop coins in hand. Okay, so now, uh, we can't open this one on the um, right side over here. Nothing happened. Don't open this one, don't open this one yet. So if we open this one, the little coffin is open. A mummy stands silently before you. So. I did not know this before, but um, we actually have to use this torch on me here. I haven't done this before, so... The mummy bursts into flames, leaving behind a scepter among the ashes. Ooh. This jewel-studded scepter is truly made for a king. Hmm. Okay. The scepter is in hand. Alright. Let's save. Okay. Okay. Let's take a look at the scepter one more time. What does it say? Jewel stud scepter. Okay. Alright. Um, you know what? Right now, let's go back in here. And I have the cloak on, but I don't know how that's going to really work. Um, so let's just try... We're probably going to get killed, but let's just, since we have the cloak on and got the scepter, let's just um, see what happens if we take something. The torch is in hand. And there go the flames. Whoosh! Flames suddenly shoot from the dragon's mouth. So that's a dragon. Flames suddenly shoot from the dragon's mouth. The cloak can't stand up to the dragon's fire. Dragon flame engulfs your body. Ouch. You pay for your curiosity with your life. So yes, we did get killed with the cloak on. Here's our death screen. It's a sad thing that your adventures have ended here. Alright, well, curiosity did kill the king. So let's go ahead and continue. Continue. If you die, you can continue where you left off. Okay, so... Let's go back in here. Can we use the scepter? On this? Nothing happened. Okay. Okay. I already saved before, so, um... Um... Let's go ahead and open this one. Put the coffins open. And it unleashes some kind of demon. As you open the tomb, a banshee flies out and emits an ear-shattering scream. You're all right, but it's very hard to hear. Okay. Okay. Um. Since I saved, we're gonna go ahead and try this. I just want to see what happens. Okay. This green slime is quite disgusting. The green slime is very thick and it's warm to the touch. Okay, can we use the torch on the slime here? You put the burning torch close to it. Sss, the flame just went out. Well, that's lovely. Okay, so the torch did not work. Okay, can we use one of the bottles on the slime? Nothing happened. Okay, model two. Nothing happened. Nice. What about this cop coin? Oh, we didn't look at these, did we? Okay, look. Hey, wait a minute. This is no gold coin. It's a brass slug. What a, what a royal rip. Okay, can we use this on the slime? Nothing happened. Uh, broom. Probably not going to work. I know neatness counts, but there would, be, there would seem to be better ways to spend your time. Thanks for the message, game. Okay. Arrow's not gonna work. Um. Scepter. 
probably not gonna work. Nothing happened. Oh, torch is out. Um, if we do try to go past the slime, it's gonna kill us. Even if we try to open it, we can't even speak to it. It's not even as communicate whatsoever. Wasting your time. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and actually um, reload. I'm gonna restart and reload my game here. Hold on a second. Kikmo presents License by Nintendo of America Incorporated. Shadow Gates. File two. Continue. Okay, so we got the scepter here. Hands of the slave mountain horse. Okay. We can't use the bottles on ourselves. Just gonna do that. Did I, tr did I ever try that with bottle one? Oh, as you consume the liquid in the vial, your body convulses. Oh. Your body convulses and death spasms quickly follow. So bottle one kills us. That's nice. Well, that was a bad idea, and I actually haven't done that before, so... Alright, well now we know. Um, let's continue. Er, not restart, sorry. I pressed restart. Push start. Uh, file two, continue. Alright, so we know not to use bottle one on ourselves now. Okay. Can we use... Ooh, hang on. Can we use bottle two in the water? Nothing happened. Nice. And of course, of course, bottle one had no effect on that slime. Um, we have the cloak on still. Okay, so... What about if we use a torch on the dragon? Okay, if I see you don't do that. Okay, so... Can we use a cop coin? Nothing happened. Okay, we can't get this thing open. Oh, can we hit it? No, it's probably not gonna work because it's locked. Pow! <laughs> I like that one. Ouch, that smarts. It's kind of like a, in cartoons, you know. You got an interjection and then you know, just something like that. Um, ooh. Can we try... Let's open this. Can we use this torch down here? Okay, but don't do that. Okay, hitting the pedestal. Pow! That smarts, okay. Alright, um, just for the sake of showing you guys, and because I already saved, let's just show you what happens if we do this, because I've already done this. Oh, it's already open. Uh, I do know that you do, um, die if you go down here at some point. A broken fragment of a wooden ladder hangs from the opening. Yep, you hear that music? As you go down the trapdoor, you realize you took a big step. The fall is quite fatal. So yes, you do die if you, um, do that. So let's continue. Okay, we're back in here. How many torches do we have? Five. Okay. Hold. Okay, move, please. Move, there you go. Okay, we stick some rotten meats. Okay, um, let's go back in here. Um, we can't move back this way yet. Can we use... Um, actually, it is very dark. We can't take this thing, can we? You can't take it. It is very dark. Wasting your time. Alright, eerie music. Okay. Um, we still have that stone taken. Um, can we use one of the cop coins down here? Will it, like, come to life or something? Nothing happened. What about, what about 
use it on ourselves. Probably a bad idea. Nothing happened. <sighs> okay, let's go back. I kind of don't like that they play that cutscene every time we come in here. Okay, stones, blah blah blah. Okay, move. Let's go back this way. Way. We cannot use that spell on here because it's going to stay like that. We can't go up this way. It's too high for you to reach. We cannot uh, use the E4 spell. Okay, so go back in here. There's a small room. Um, can we use torch? Oh wait, no, we tried that. Never mind. Um, what does this thing say again? Polygon. Character playing the stone. Um, hmm, can we try using this scepter? Nothing happened. Of course. Hmm. Let's go upstairs. Oh wait, I didn't mean to go that way. Whoops. Okay. Can we use the sword to hit one of the mirrors here? Nothing happened. Okay, Spectre. Scepter, sorry. Nothing happened. Okay, uh... Okay, I'm gonna have to stop... I'm gonna have to uh, pause for one second and see what to do next, because I am stumped. So, be right back. Okay, we are back. Alright, so let's go ahead and... Go back up this way. Okay, so I did quickly look. Uh, we are supposed to go back in this area. And go back in here. And what I actually didn't realize is, let's put on another torch for one second. You know what? Hold on. Let's let's restart because I didn't really do much. I just wasted a torch. So push start. File two. Continue. All right. So let's move. Okay. Go back in here. And we got a torch there still. That's about to run out. Move. And I didn't realize you could actually move through uh, this uh, con this uh, little uh, narrow path right here. The walls in this room are much too close to comfort. The damp walls of this eerie cavern are rough and irregular. Okay, I didn't realize you could do this. So um, this rock is quite loose. So we need to hit this. You hit the rock as hard as you can. Pow. Loose rock falls down as it, as it as if hinged to the wall. Looks like we have a sack in here. It's a leather pouch. Bag one was taken. Ooh, so there's our bag one. Okay, let me examine what's left in here. It's a stone wall. Okay. Third. Oh, oops. I'm supposed to move. Okay, so let's open bag one here. Back when it's open. The bag contains three large jewels. Ooh. So a white gem, a red gem, and a blue gem. Hmm. Let's go back to that scroll and see what that scroll said. Wait, hold on. Let's first off, let's take the wait, no, never mind. Let's go back to the scroll and see what it reads. Okay. No, no, read. Five to find, three are one. One gives access to the bladed sun. The silver orb to banish below the staff ages of Necros the Foe. Joining two of the golden blade, the last turn of the find no more. Okay, let's take... Wait, where are we supposed to go? Oh, I go back this way. There we go. Let's look at each uh, gem here. It's a white stone of unknown origin. A fine thing to gamble away in a good car game. card game. 
It's a fine red ruby. Oh, its color reminds you of your adventures across the Sea of Blood. <sighs> blue gem. It's a dark blue gemstone that is as big as the pommel of a sword. Hmm, well, you know, if you remember an uninvited, uh, taking a ruby would eventually uh, cause you to die. But I don't know what it's going to be for this, like for this game, so let's... Just take this red gem. The red gem is in hand. Let's take the white gem. And let's take the blue gem. Okay. So, let's close the bag. The bag one is closed, and let's, I think we also didn't close bag two. Okay. Um, so... Back here in this shark room. Okay, let me see what that said for the for the red thing again. Oh, look at that red, white, blue. The colors of the U.S. flag. Awesome. It's a fine red ruby. Remind, reminds you of your adventure across the sea of blood. Hmm. Red gem. Can you use this on the water? Nothing happened. Is it not self? Nothing happened. Um, can we leave this? Best if you don't do that, okay. Um, I wonder if we can um, put one of these gems on that one thing in the... Uh, oops, torch is going out. Torch, act, equip it. Okay, uh, where was it? Right here. I wonder if we can um, use one of those on the... Uh, uh, thing in the cave down here. No, why do I keep doing that? Okay, blah blah blah. Let's go back down here. Okay, small room. Okay, take a quick look at this one more time. Okay, concave polygon. Can we put one of these gems on this thing? Gem seems to fit, but nothing happens. Oh, there we go. As soon as you place the blue gem in the hole, you hear the sound of grinding stone. The wall slowly rises to reveal a magical image of an old wizard. Listen, warrior. The warlock lord can only be defeated by thy courage and the staff of ages. Remember, five to find. Three for the staff. Three for the staff, one to be the key, and one to be thy pathway. Have thy wits about thee, warrior. Fare thee well. The wall slides back into place, hiding the image from your sight. A scroll appears. Okay, that was completely new to me. I didn't even know that was going to happen. Okay. It's an ancient leather-bound parchment, so let's take it, of course. Scroll two is in hand. An ancient leather bound parchment. Oh, we have to do we have to open this? Scroll 2 is open. You've read the scroll. The scroll reads, As the shadow of the wind, as the shadow of the wind, thou shalt be Humana. So another spell. You've learned one magic spell. As the spell was chanted, the scroll too quickly vanished. So we have remembered the spell. I want to take a look at that spell one more time. As the shadow of the wind, thou shalt be. All right, let's. Um, um, I'm gonna stop right here, and I'm actually gonna go back and um, do all this again, so we don't, so we don't uh, use up um, any more of our torches. So um, we'll be back in the next part, part four. So until then, this is 53 plays saying, have a good day, and we'll see you for more fun and games in the castle of Shadowgate. See you next time, everyone.